Former Oregon Duck, current Seattle Seahawk. Let's start there, man. How did it feel to sign up for Seahawks? It felt really good. You know, I, I've always been a fan of the Seahawks and the production they put out and then everything they put out over the years. Uh, but to get a chance to play with the guys like Russell Wilson and some of the other guys on the offense, it's, you know, it's going to be a test. You know, I'm ready. Up, up and ready for the challenge. I know they're transitioning offensive playbooks a little bit and yeah. uh, they bring in Schottenheimer. Have you been able to connect with Brian at all and get a feel for what his system might be like? Yeah, I mean, uh, that's that's the first kind of connection that I made. When I went there, you know, I had a chance to get a feel for what Marty was doing and then with, with, with Russell where he wanted to go in his career. And then, you know, I, I took my trips and made, made a decision. You just have to get, get, out, get back over to the Pacific Northwest and play some football. How excited are you uh, to play ball with Russ? Oh my God, he, he's a competitor, man. I, I've, I've been with some talented quarterbacks in, in my past, you know, with Joe Flacco and Cam Newton, but Russ, you know, he probably takes the kick. Let's go, I want to go back to Carolina because you got to play with Jay Stu and a, a lot of former guys with Oregon ties there. You're, you've got to be fond of that place. What was it like to play in Carolina? Well, it was, it was initially, it was something new, going away from everything I knew in, in uh, Baltimore. But when I got there, you know, I just let, you know, hard work take over and be, be the chance to, to play with some guys that I was familiar with like Jay Stu and, and Kenyon was there and then Brandon Williams was there and then a couple other guys was there before me but just to test get, get familiar faces you know they help the, the, the growing process and, and fitting in and everything. So you're back in Eugene you walk in Autzen Stadium you've got the feel of the spring game yeah what kind of emotions come to mind? Everything man it's, it's the big games that went down here you know it's, we're, we're some of the first teams that laid foundation for the regime of you know it never rains in Austin Stadium, that kind of phrase, or, you know, big games against, you know, uh, Oregon State or, or Washington or something like that, you know, it, this, this is the place that laid the foundation for me to further my career in the NFL. Is it cool to be able to reconnect with teammates? Like, I know LeGarrette's here, a bunch of other former Ducks are here, Marcus is here. How cool is that? These are friends for life, you know, you, you meet these guys uh, in your collegiate career, but they're always going to be brothers and friends for life. That's awesome, man. And have you gotten to know Mario Cristobal at all, or what do you think of the new coaching staff? I know there's been some changes recently. I'm fired up. I'm fired up. You know, I got a chance to meet him last night, uh, and just to hear him talk, how passionate he is about bringing winning back here at Austin Stadium. Uh, he has the support of everybody in the NFL, all the NFL Ducks, and even the past Ducks that they played here. You know, you can't be you can't be more than happy than fired up for that guy to help you know the program get back to where it was. Now I know you're MCN slash hosting an event coming up tonight. Yeah. Are you? Over, does that make you nervous at all, or is that just fun know. for you? It's just fun for me. Yeah. You know, uh, I get a chance to the host at the club tonight. Uh, my boy Leon and a couple of the guys. You know, come out and support, you know, see how tight end Ed Dixon here in, you know, Eugene, beautiful Eugene, out here supporting a good cause. Come out and support it. There it is, my man. Of course. Appreciate you very much.